Hello, Harmonaut and fellow crypto angels. We're going to be talking about Harmony, their great news, what is coming next, and also to address some fear and doubt that has been there. Some people have been saying that Harmony has not been moving fast enough, that they're concerned with the price action because they bought in around 15 cents. And why isn't it moving? <laughs> We're going to address that. And also someone in our community, they asked, should, you know, is it time to sell their harmony and go and put that into XRP? Well, I'm going to share personally what my thoughts are on, on that. And of course, each one of us has to do what we feel is right for our own portfolio, our finances, position. Everything I share here is not personal advice. This is just a purely my point of view. And I want to hear your point of view too in the comments. I'm Joanna Garcilly. This is Crypto Angel Network. This would not be a network without you. So I really, really appreciate you being here and how you're answering each other's questions within the community. That absolutely delights me. And also we need to do an angel card. Yes, we are going to be doing an angel card for Harmony because that is what we do. Because a lot of, I find a lot of the Harmony community and what I love is very spiritually awake, super conscious. And that is why Harmony is my favorite token out of all the different projects that are out there. And you know, you may have a different favorite project. Fantastic. There's many great things, but Harmony is the one. <laughs> So we're going to do the angel card afterwards and let's see what happens with that. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen right now so we can get into just just to be able to just take a moment here, uh, which is I think is important when when fear comes up, when when from a psychological standpoint, we feel things aren't moving fast enough. So right here, I am in the Harmony chart. And, and I just, I wanted to just show you here this, I, I love sometimes in the comments when people will say when there's fear, zoom out. Well, look, here's the zoom out of Harmony One. And if we go all the way back here, look at this, just like little blip, little blip. What do we got here? All the way along here, 0 0.000, 9, it looks like, if I can see that, around that. And, and then we started to go parabolic here, right? I mean, just look at this. We hit an all-time high of 22 and a half cents. And so with some of the comments saying when we went down to 15 cents after hitting that all-time high, is something wrong with Harmony? Should one sell? Again, you have to make that decision. But I can just tell you that I am not selling. I did, I had bought a whole load of Harmony. I did take some profits and then I held onto my Harmony and then I bought back in and bought some more. And again, whatever that, whatever feels right for you, whether you're a hodler, whether you're swing trading, that is very personal. What I'm noticing on, on YouTube and just in general and Twitter and the whole crypto community is that it, 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 it is quite, I mean, it is quite, it is quite varied. And, and I am newer to this space. I've only really been trading for now for properly for just for four months. And so this is a learning process for me. But from my basic understanding, from what I see here, is that you know, we are just in a period of consolidation. And this is this consolidation is so, I mean, it's really, look, there was, bet, I mean, this is parabolic here. And, and this consolidation, why go out of this into XRP? That's just my thinker. I know people are talking about XRP hitting $100. Actually, in 2017, I bought XRP at 23 cents. And, and then I did sell it at around, gosh, what did I sell it at? I have to check. I think around around 30 cents I sold it at. You know, I took very, very small profits. But for me, the, the challenge for, for me with XRP is that I just feel that the manipulation, the sort of the volatility with it, and I don't feel that with Harmony. I just feel that, I mean, it hasn't, thank goodness, I just feel like it hasn't been poisoned yet in some capacity. And I believe because of the leadership of Harmony, because of that team and the way that they have thought out the roadmap so carefully, 
that I do not anticipate them being poisoned or going through massive market manipulation. I feel like they're going to have consistent, steady growth. And that is why I personally, this is just my personal opinion, I feel very, very bullish and extremely positive about Harmony. Super, super positive. So look, we're just in this period of consolidation. If we just come over to the other chart here, I just want to show you this from the, the, the different view. Let's go over to the trading view here to see the, um, we're on the one day here. And okay, look, this is just totally to me, this is totally normal consolidation. Let me know in the comments what you think. We had, look, we had this bigger volume here and, and we're going to have that volume coming again. So the fact that we are at just under 16 cents and we don't have a lot of volume and we're absolutely not overbought in any capacity, I believe for, for my price prediction, I would say by the end of this month, what we're at the 15th now, we've got another 15 days before the end of the month, we should go up to 30 cents. We should be, we're getting ready to run up to that 30 cents. And if it doesn't happen exactly at the end of April by April 30th, well, then it's definitely going to happen by mid-May. I mean, it just, just look, this is not rocket science here. You can just see as more and more awareness goes out there about the, the, the project. And if we just hop over, and I'm going to get to the Harmony News in a second, if we just go to Harmony 1, you can see here, like, why? Like, why go out of, of this into XRP if you're ready whole Harmony? I just... I would just stick with it because the market cap isn't crazy right now. It's not like we've got a $41 million market cap with Cardano. And we, we know that Cardano, yes, that's a huge, you know, it's a huge project and, and can have massive gains. But I just, I feel peaceful within Harmony. I just feel, and I just love this number with the circulating supply. Look, it's over three quarters of their circulating supply is there. So it, it's not like we're going to go through even more dilution. And then we look at the gains over a year. Everyone needs to calm down. If, if things aren't pumping all the time, it's like, oh, why aren't I getting enough gains? Oh my gosh, Harmony is falling apart. It's not falling apart at all. Look, 7,000% gains. 80% gains in the past 30 days, we went through some correction there because the month before it was around 290% in gains. So just figure, I mean, in these months ahead, it is very realistic for us to go and hit a dollar. And let's just take a moment here. I just want to remind everyone where people are concerned that Harmony is going to go down the toilet in some capacity. Oh, it's on them, on Stephen's... Um, Steve, um, Stephen, Stephen C, who's the founder here of, of One. Look, I just want to remind everyone, his pin tweet, they're hiring that if Harmony wasn't going to be successful, if it was going to go down the toilet, don't you think by now, why would they be going and, and saying, we're looking for referrals with five plus years experience? Look at all the people that they're hiring. So I just want to remind anyone that is feeling fearful about Harmony right now. And I would just say, don't panic if you hold it, because I think that you will be disappointed later on. And um Here's the news. Here's their latest news, which I think is amazing. This is where Harmony keeps keeping, keeps delivering. And this is their partnership with Swift Blockchain. And something very important that I just learned recently is when doing my due diligence at looking at the difference between when is there, you know, sort of that an integration on the blockchain and, and also like a very specific partnership where you have two projects working together. So this is definitely something where they're working together. And this news is, I think, what's going to lead to another pump. And we should go back to that where we hit that all-time high of the 22 and a half cents. Harmony One Digital Payments with Swift Payment Network use one swaps, red packets, and payments. And so, again, this is the distinction. I just, I just learned people on Chain Games, some of them are very upset with me because, you know, I thought that Epic... Games had a partnership with Chain Games, and that is why I bought Chain Games based off of that news. And then I found out that it was they were just doing an integration, it wasn't a partnership, and that Chain Games is not allowed to use they're not allowed to um, use Fortnite, they can't put it on their blockchain. 
And, and so again, this is where you have to do your d- due diligence and see what for you are deal breakers, what is important for you, because it's your hard earned cash, you get to decide what tokens you get to go into. And for some people, you know, some people are just looking to just day trade, they're just looking at how they can make a quick buck. And for other people, I think it's about it is about the fundamentals. Some people truly I hear some people who are the hardcore day traders and like, Oh, well, you're just in it to make money. Yes, of course. I know I'm in it to make money. But I also liked the idea of being a crypto angel is that that the project that it, there really is a resonance uh, for one and that and that it feels good and it aligns with one's core values you know so again just going back to this example with with chain games is that when i found out epic games said well we just don't for our community this is, is you know there's an element of gambling here i personally i don't like gambling i don't do that and i had to rethink why i went into it so good luck to everyone in chain games and i'm sure it's going to do great but i just i i know the communities that i want to be part of and so those are the decisions the things that i'm learning and how i'm trying to decide what projects to go into moving forward and for someone else that might be you know what they don't want to stick in harmony and they want to go to xrp instead we each have different goals so here we have this partnership expands usage of one through wechat which is huge, Alibaba and, and Beidou. These combined have over 3 billion transactions annually. That is a big, big deal. I mean, again, and this is why just Harmony keeps making these announcements. And uh, through the cooperation with Swift, Harmony users can adopt it in one-stop cross-chain transfer solution to more easily and quickly apply one tokens, more applications bring more value to themselves. And I was very excited recently about Harmony having their partnership with Travala as well, where you can use the one tokens with Travala. And I actually, I did get some Travala and, and stick a little bit of that in my portfolio too, because if I see the Harmony is doing something with a certain token, so I guess, you know, with Swift, that's another token. I don't have that, but I think that that could be, you know, these are things where, it's exciting. One gets to be part of the project. And then you can see here using one on Swift Pay. Grab the Swift app from the Apple App Store and start today. Below some screenshots of the product flow and how to use one. And so you can take a look at that. You, you, you know, you can look up this article, do your own due diligence, look more carefully. But again, the main reason why I wanted to go and do an update here is just for people who have been having concerns or who are worried about what Harmony is doing, I <laughs> just say, don't worry. And um, I just want to show here briefly, this is the software I use, uh, Coin Tracker, for doing for all my taxes. And um, so right now, um, what I was saying with uh, but Harmony. So I, I still have, you know, at one point I did have 100,001 and I had taken profit. So I've got just over 60,000. And I personally, just being transparent, I am keeping this Harmony. I, I'm, I'm not planning on selling anytime soon. I, I'm going to be holding this for quite a while, I say quite a while. I mean, I, I'm, I feel very confident that Harmony will hit at least $1. And even then say, if I were to take some profits on it at that point, I will still keep some one. I will, def- I will always keep some one, even for when we go into a bear market, I will maintain some, I think I will maintain at least 10,001 because I think what's important to look at of what Harmony is going to do in these years ahead. So I'm up just right now, close to 22%. And then I recently just, again, these are tiny gains. I decided to go into Travala. I nearly went in the other day when it was $5. It just pumped up to six, but I'm not concerned because I just want to hold my, my entry point there. And, um, and then, um, yeah, so that's just my thinking. So I just have 100 AVA, but I do, let me just say, I have, and again, this is just my thinking. I could be totally wrong, but I just have a feeling that Travala is going to follow what Shopping.io has done, where Shopping.io hit over $200 and had an all-time high of 300 Let me know in the comments what you think, because I, I just have a, Trava, that, a feeling that Travala is going to go over $100 at a certain point. Maybe I'm totally delusional. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what I think. So um, 
so just the game just coming back here you know th I, this we got to i think we're going to be able to we're going to break out let's just take a brief look at on the 15 minutes here i mean now if you're not in harmony right now before it goes to 30 cents i would say now is a good time to get in all right and my gardeners are outside if you hear any mowing we're going to go to <laughs> All right, we're going to go to angel cards. Let's go to angel cards. This is what we're going to do. All right. So um, this is for Harmony. This is going to be for the next seven days for Harmony. Let's pick the card and just see what is the focus. What do the Harmonauts need to know? What is our alignment? Okay. I like this. This token is openness. Our token is openness here. I've got the lot that, can you hear this outside? <laughs> of course, right when I'm doing this. So, okay, well, at least the garden's getting clean. So openness. And I would just say that I feel like the message in this is how can you have an open mind, an open heart, be open to growth, be open to the idea that things can go well. And just the question I would ask yourself in terms of also as a um, being in the space, being in crypto, whether you've been in it for a while or, or if you're new to it, is how can you see things in a new way? How, because a lot of the time, I'm noticing sometimes when I share something out there, if it's not something that someone wants to hear, they get very, very upset with me. And I don't just see it with me. I see it happen on other channels as well. And, and that is when one has a closed mind. So I just think that if one allows oneself to be open, that there really is that opportunity to be able to not just make financial gains, but also to grow. I think that that, is one of the things that in this past few months in crypto, as a human being, I have grown a lot. I have learned a lot about myself. I have learned about the shadow parts of myself where I thought I wasn't greedy, that I can be greedy, where I thought, oh, I'm not scared. I definitely fear comes up. Where I thought I'm very good at being centered, grounded and connected to spirit, that actually there were times when I totally shut down and and just was not grounded that I was uncentered and I reacted emotionally to things so that is where I found that I've this has been a great opportunity to really learn more about myself and I think that that is a greater thing about being in crypto and the way that I see whatever token one's in, whether it's harmony or something else, that people who are in the space, who are in crypto, really are visionary, they are forward thinking, and, and the majority of people who are in crypto are older souls, they really are growing, and I think it's very exciting to see how things are going to evolve in these years ahead, and I feel that with everything within blockchain, that the future is very, very bright. And I feel that Harmony is going to become very much a centrifugal force, a positive force in the entire blockchain and creating massive innovation. And that this is just the beginning. 10 years from now, Harmony will have made a huge, huge impact. And it'll be exciting to look back at this decade of where we are right now in 2021. I'm Joanna Garzilli. This is Crypto Angel Network. Thank you for subscribing to the channel, for liking, and especially your comments. You will hear from me personally. If you see some type of thing from WhatsApp and to invest, that's not me, that's a scanner. So I promise I will be replying to you and thank you once again. And I am sending you lots and lots of love.